Welcome to Electron Online, and now that we've got a bunch of these identities under control, at least we think we do, let's go ahead and try our hand at this one. Let's, see, let's show that the left side equals the right side. Okay, um, here we have something that looks a lot like the difference of squares. If we rewrite it like this, it becomes more obvious. What if we have the cosine square of x, quantity square, minus the sine square of x, quantity square, equals... Yeah, I can go ahead and put the equal sign there. All right. So now you can see it's a difference of squares. We can be factored, and it will look like this. It will be the cosine square of x plus the sine square of x multiplied times the cosine square of x minus the sine square of x. And that equals, well, we'll see what it equals. And uh, now you can see that this is equal to 1. So... I like to write the equal sign in the front rather than the back. Let me do that. So equals, equals. It's a little easier to work with. So this becomes 1 times the cosine square of x minus the sine square of x. And maybe some of you might already recognize that this is equal to an identity, but we'll leave that till later. All right, now, what I'm going to do here is go back and remember this one. So if we have the cosine of a plus b, that is equal to the cosine of a times the cosine of b. And if this is plus, it becomes minus sine of a, sine of b. And then if I make that a plus a, let's see what happens. So the cosine of a plus a, that is equal to the cosine of a times the cosine of a minus the sine of a times the sine of a. If I simplify that, this is equal to the cosine squared of a minus the sine squared of a, which is what I have over here. So that means that this cannot be written as, so this is equal to, and of course, 1 times that would be um, the cosine of x plus x, which of course is equal to the cosine of 2x, which is what I have over there. So in other words, the cosine squared of x minus the sine squared of x is indeed equal to the cosine of 2x which is equal to what we have over there. So we've proven this identity. That's how we do that.